Whether you're just beginning to create your very own podcast or you're looking to grow your existing one, where you decide to host your podcast is a subject that will need to be put on the table. In case you needed a quick reminder, a podcast is an audio file available on the internet for downloading to a computer or a mobile device. Usually, podcasts are available as a series of episodes revolving around a particular theme. Because the internet is filled with many places to store and broadcast your work, it's important to know from the start what you can expect to get out of the podcast hosting site that you choose. Hello everyone, this is Mark from 925software.com. Here we'll look at some of the best website builders for podcasts currently available on the market, and also include further options to consider. Check out the links in the comments to get a free trial and a discount to the applications that we look at. Before further ado, let's get started. PodcastPage.io A website builder that is easy to use yet powerful and feature rich. A modern platform professionally designed and optimized for today's web. Built from the ground up specifically for podcasting, allowing podcasters to create podcast websites in minutes. PodcastPage.io does not require any coding skills at all. It's intuitive for non-developers and developers as well. Your podcast page website comes with unlimited blog posts and additional pages. You can customize the audio player or embed the audio player of your podcast host if you prefer. You can start your website from one of the podcast templates that are included in all of the plans, or you can customize the layout to fit your desired design easily. To get started with podcastpage.io, all you need is to start your free trial. Add your podcast RSS feed URL and that's it! A fully featured website is already there for you in a matter of seconds. Now you can customize the colors, change the logo and layouts, or add more content if needed. Lastly, it's easy to use a custom domain to make it under your own podcast name and really have full control of your podcast and brand. Squarespace Squarespace is a very popular platform among website owners. They offer a content management system which is, arguably, less flexible but easier to start with than WordPress. They have some themes for blogs, restaurants, small businesses, and podcasts. Additionally, Squarespace has no plugins or extensions, but they do offer a way to add your podcast RSS feed in the settings. Squarespace's biggest benefit is that you can host your podcast episodes right on your site, no external host necessary. All plans give you unlimited storage space and bandwidth, so you don't have to worry about running out of resources once your podcasts gain popularity. You can choose one of Squarespace's six recommended templates for podcasters or start with any other template and customize it to suit your needs. In addition, Squarespace gives you all the benefits of a full-fledged website builder, beautiful mobile responsive templates, endless options for personalization, built-in SEO tools, and even e-commerce features if you're thinking of selling merchandise or digital items online. One small downside is that Squarespace does not support video episodes. You can, of course, embed videos in any blog post, but they will not be included in your podcast feed. Wix While the Wix podcast player isn't a traditional hosting platform, it's certainly one of the easiest and most stylish ways to showcase your podcast on your website no matter where your host is. The best part is that the initial setup just requires your podcast's RSS feed URL. From there, the player will do the rest for you. Like magic, the player will begin populating the page with your logo, all of your episodes, and their accompanying photos and descriptions. Plus, it will produce a set of dynamic pages, meaning it instantly creates a page for each episode using a uniform format. Therefore, each episode will open on its own page, yet the design will remain consistent throughout, all with zero work on your end. After it's set up, you can go ahead and customize the player's style and design so it merges well with the rest of your site. Wix 